Yo, what the f*** is going on, guys? Okay, first of all, I would like to explain why I censor. So, um, <clears throat> so, the reason I censor is because, I don't know, I do not like... I'm gonna be honest, I cuss a lot in real life. Not too, too much, but like, I, like every once in a while I'll cuss. But the only reason I, I censored on YouTube is because, you know, like, I just want to be like, I don't know, I don't... For me, cuss, like, I don't like cussing on YouTube. I don't know why, I don't like... Like, whenever I watch people and they cuss, like, it isn't... I don't know, I just prefer to watch people who don't cuss on YouTube. It's like, I don't, I don't know how to explain it. I'll, okay, Nigahiga and Chris MD. I really enjoy their videos. I don't know why, but, uh, like, okay, first of all, they're really great YouTubers. They're funny and all of that. But, like, they don't cuss. And I don't know why, but I, don't, I like that. I like people who censor their stuff or just don't cuss at all. So I prefer to do that myself. So if any of you are wondering why I always censor my videos, that's why. I just don't prefer cussing. I prefer keeping it, I guess, rated whatever. <laughs> rated whatever. But yeah, let me get onto the video here. So I know Copa America has already started, but we're only two games in. So, or we're only three games in now, I think, three or four. But that's not going to determine anything. So what this is going to be is a Copa America discussion. Sorry if you can hear my dog in the background. If she gets too loud, I'll stop it or whatever. But this is going to be a Copa America group stage predictions. So I'm just going to be going on and predicting the uh, Copa America. So let me go here. I have this app. If you don't got, if you guys don't have this app, it, it's really cool. Like it's called FOTMOB, F-O-T-M-O-B. I'll leave a link in the description below to, to it on Play Store. It's really cool. Like literally, it's just a soccer app. You can create your favorite team and all that kind of stuff or not create your favorite team but like favorite your team like if you're a barca fan or england fan or whatever you can favorite them but yeah okay let me get on now so the people that i'm going for in the copa america i've said this before i'm going for usa Ar argentina and brazil now brazil is my absolute favorite international team of all time but i don't want them winning and well i will i prefer them winning over somebody else other than my two favorite teams but i don't um out of my two favorite teams, I don't want them winning. I'd prefer, first off, I'd pref I want Argentina to win because of Messi. Like, Messi needs to win something. He hasn't won the last two international finals he's played in. And for being the top three players in the world, he really deserves to win something. So I think, I, I want Messi to win. I want Argentina to win. And if they don't win, I want it to be USA. Just because they're the underdogs, they're not gonna win. They've already lost to Colombia. Just they're, they're not gonna win. I, I would love if they won, but you know, I just doubt they are And then third is Brazil. Honestly, I'm, I don't like I think there's a Brazil game going on right now Let me go check if there's a Brazil. I'm a horrible Brazil fan like they're my favorite international team of all time I love them almost as much as I love Barca, but Neymar is not playing Neymar is my favorite player He's not the reason I like Brazil. It's just that like when he's not playing the games are they're I don't know, they're not boring, I just prefer not to watch them, even though this is Copa America, but after, like, to be honest, after the World Cup, it hasn't been so interesting with Brazil. Like, I haven't been like, oh, I'll go watch that because I think they're going to win. Let me check real quick if they're playing, though. Okay, as soon as I turn my TV on, like, the very first thing that I see is Brazil. Seriously. Like, as soon as I turn it on, Brazil's playing, as you can see right there. Uh, the score is 0-0. Zero, zero. We got Willian taking a kick, a uh, free kick, or a corner kick, and yeah. Uh, cheers. Cheers, Jeff. But yeah, so Brazil is playing now. 0-0 uh, against Ecuador. Uh, I'm pretty sure Brazil is going to win, but you know what? I'm going to watch the game after I'm done filming. I might as well. So yeah, Brazil is my third team in this one, even though they're my first team overall. But okay, let's see. Let's go ahead and check out the table now. So in, in Group A for the Copa America, we have Colombia, Costa Rica, Paraguay, and USA. Now the two teams that I think are going to make it out of here are either... Okay, Colombia to me is for sure getting out. Okay, to, Colombia to me is for sure getting out of the, of the group stage. I don't see them not winning. And then we have Costa Rica, Paraguay, and USA. Now, I don't know why. I don't know how Costa Rica tied with Paraguay. They're better than that, but they did tie with them. So, I was leaning towards Costa Rica, but it's either USA or Costa Rica. And Pedro, Pedro Guay is not making it out for sure. Well, not for, it's not for sure. It's never for sure, but I don't see them making it out. I see USA making out, making it out over Costa Rica or over Paraguay. But, 
Costa Rica or USA? Uh, that one's gonna be hard, but I'm gonna give it to... Uh, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and give it to Costa Rica. I, you know what? No, I'm gonna give it to USA. I could see USA making out Colombia. Costa Rica and USA play in three days actually. So we'll go ahead and see. That one's on Tuesday. Yeah, so I see USA making it out. Um, they probably beat Costa Rica both times that they play. I think they play twice. Oh, okay, no, I'm wrong. Most tournaments usually play twice around time. Or I don't, I don't know about international tournaments, but you know how like Champions League, you play twice in the group stage. They don't do that here, but like I said, I do see USA beating Costa Rica. Their next match is their most important. And if they do not win the next match, they're out of the Champions League. So that's that. And so Colombia and USA will make it out. Paraguay to me is most likely not winning a single game at all, and if they do, it's going to be against USA. Uh, they've already drew against Costa Rica, so that's that. I see USA making it out along with Colombia in first place. Here in Group B, we have Peru, Brazil, Ecuador, and Haiti. Um, that one's pretty simple. I think it's going to be Brazil and Ecuador. Peru already beat Haiti 1-0, and uh, Brazil and Ecuador are playing right now. It's still 0-0, but I do see Brazil. I can't see Brazil not making it out the group stage. Like I, I just don't think it's not. I don't think it's possible for them not to make it out the group stage. So Brazil is going to make it out the group stage, and probably in first place. And then I see Ecuador in second. They're playing right now. Honestly, I don't know who's gonna win this one. I well, I said Brazil. I think it's going to be Brazil, but you never know for sure when it comes to football. You never know for sure who's going to win. And so, sorry, I keep looking over here because the game, like, Brazil right now is dominating. Here in Group C, we have Jamaica, Mexico, Uruguay, and Venezuela. So, this is probably the more boring group. I see Mexico and either Venezuela or Uruguay making it out. Yeah, okay, I got Mexico and Uruguay. So those two are going to make it out. Mexico's a great international team. They're always the underdogs, but I can always see them coming out the group stage no matter what. They're hard fighters, and they're a very good team overall. So I see Mexico making it out, and Uruguay second. Um, Suarez, let's hope he scores some bangers or something. I don't know, but I can't wait for the Uruguay versus Mexico game. I think Mexico will win. Probably overrating Mexico. Who knows, but let's see. Um, and then the final group, which is Group D, we have Argentina, Bolivia, Chile, and Panama. So in this one, it's so simple. It's Argentina and Chile. The, the, like there's, there shouldn't be a debate about that. Argentina and Chile are making it out the group stage. No matter how you look at it, they're the ones who are going to make it out. Uh, they made it to the finals last year, and they'll do it again. So that's the prediction for the group stages, guys. I'll be back once the group stage is over. I'll discuss everything, all my predictions, if they were wrong, if they were right how I feel about who made it out and all of that. So, as I said, Colombia, USA, Brazil, Ecuador, Mexico, Uruguay, and Argentina and Chile. Those are the teams making it out. Uh, I think I'll go ahead, um, you've already seen it if I've done it, but I think I'll go ahead and like put the group stages in the corner of the screen when I'm talking about them, so you can go ahead and see the teams and their flags or whatever if you don't know which country I'm talking about. But that's been the video, guys. Um, hope you enjoyed it. If you want me to do more of these, Leave a like down below and comment if you enjoyed this video. And make sure, if this is your first time watching, make sure you leave a subscribe. I make FIFA videos and all types of other uh, videos and gaming videos. Um, I'm a little tired right now. I'm sorry. I'm, like My eyes are really low. <clears throat> the reason I haven't uploaded is because I just had a baby sister yesterday. Or, yeah, yesterday, my dad and my stepmom had a baby. So, it's, it, it's my first, like, sibling ever. I'm... I'm 17 years old and I have not had a sibling before. Like, that's crazy. So I'm, I'm having a half sister now. I'm gonna, of course, count it as my my real full sister a bit. Even, but even though it is my half sister, and I do have two step brothers, but I don't have any real family members until now. I have a, or real siblings until now. I have a, a sister. So that's why I haven't been uploading. I haven't been making a video. I've been at the hospital lately, and yeah, uh, she's really beautiful. I love her a lot, but. Thanks for watching the video, guys. Make sure you do whatever. Leave a like, comment down below, subscribe. If it's your first time watching, if you enjoy my videos. And the game is still 0-0, zero, zero, so we're going to go ahead and dab way our, our way out of this video. Uh, I don't know if I cut that or not. That was kind of nasty.